Hi, um, what I want to show you today is a, a new piece of kit which I think might have some interesting applications for musicians. Uh, this thing I'm holding here in my hand, it's not a USB drive, this is actually a completely functional Windows 8.1 PC. Um, quite an amazing little device, uh, comes with an HDMI connector on the end here, um, you've got an on-off switch, you've got a micro USB for power, you've got a full-sized USB for plugging something else into, you've got a slot for an SD card up to, they say, 128 gig, and this is a fully functional PC. So I'm just going to plug it in and I'm going to show you it running uh, power music. You could carry around in this probably something like 50, 60,000 pieces of music and all you need is a monitor with an HDMI socket. You plug it in and all your music's immediately available. So it comes with this little adapter or you can just plug it straight into the monitor. I'll plug it into the adapter and it comes with a, a USB power supply which I'll plug in here and to switch it on you just press and hold the button for a couple of seconds and it'll come up. Um, I'll just talk a wee bit about the spec of this. It, it comes with a 32 gig solid state drive, um, 2 gig of RAM, runs full Windows 8.1. It's got Wi-Fi built in, it's got Bluetooth 4 built in, and uh, it's basically the, 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 the guts of a, a tablet, like the, the Lynx 10 tablet, in this tiny little stick here. So there we are, we're, we're starting up the, the Windows 8 screen. And that's it started up. It's reasonably fast. It's got an Atom processor. Um, the interesting thing is, of course, you can plug in, if you want, a, a, an actual keyboard and mouse through a wee, a wee um, hub there. Or you can connect Bluetooth devices. So, for instance, this is one of these really cheap little Bluetooth um, keyboards. Uh, it's got a touchpad on it as well. Or you can put on a proper full-size Bluetooth keyboard like this. Okay, so I'm going to show you Power Music now running on this little uh, PC stick. Um, the desktop started up, so I'll just go down and launch Power Music. The version of Power Music we're running on here is the latest version of Power Music Professional. And that's it started up. Uh, I've got some piano music selected in the library, so I'll go to there. And I will put a couple of pieces into a playlist. So I want to put uh, this piece in here. So I'll just double click on that, put it in the playlist, and I'll choose that one as well. And this one here. Okay, so now I go to my playlist and bring it up on full screen. Now you'll notice that I've got a number of different pedals all connected here. This is really just to show what is possible. I have connected through USB. I have one of the Billy Pro pedals and it's plugging into the USB socket here. And I can use that for page turning, uh, forward and back, through there. I also have got a page flip uh, Firefly, it's a Bluetooth pedal. And it pairs very nicely with this. And again, you just tap the pedal and you can turn your pages. And if you get to the end of the song, it moves on to the next song in the playlist. And here we have the latest pedal, this is the, the Air Turn Ped. Again, it's a Bluetooth, it's one of the new Bluetooth 4 standard, so it shows that the PC here actually supports the latest uh, Bluetooth Smart standard. And again, just tap the pedal and you can turn the page. So you've got a huge uh, a variety of things you can connect to this little device uh, through Bluetooth. What you can also do is just, um, as a matter of interest, is that although there's Wi-Fi built in there, you can actually connect a wired network. This is just a little um, USB to uh, LAN connector. I plugged that in and it meant I had a faster connection when I wanted to download the updates and things for the, um, the little PC. If anything, the one of the weakest things in it is, is the Wi-Fi. You have to have a fairly strong Wi-Fi signal uh, if you're wanting to do anything very intensive using Wi-Fi, but it works perfectly well if you get a good signal. So that's that's a little um, PC stick. I think it's got a great future. I think there's a, quite a number of products we could look at, linking it with different pedals and things, different keyboards for use with power music. As I say, all you do is put your music on the stick, plug the stick into the monitor if it's got a, an HDMI socket, and you're ready to go with a digital music stand.